course to my exact plan. Now it's time for you to deliver, just like a postman. Biology, it's an ideology. It explains how organisms work, shedding light on the earth. Thanks to most scientists, we know how stuff exists. It used to be biblical, like Cain and Abel, but I prefer stuff like Mendeleev and his periodic table. Forget Ronaldo or Beyonce, scientists are the real heroes of our day. Plans do photosynthesis for us to have our fish and chips. But I'll tell you what's perverse. Photosynthesis is respiration in reverse. Hey! Hey! If you make that link, then in your exam you shouldn't sink. The carbon cycle brings it all together, like a chicken gravy in a roast dinner. But what is better than a double bill of Doctor Who? Mitosis, y'all, and how one cell becomes two. Hey! It's not voodoo, it's just how cells divide to make you. Proteins make up 50% of your cells. Without them, you would be like gel. But boys, don't OD on the stuff. It won't make you more buff. Just 50% more like a sugar puff. Hey! <laughs> what about DNA? As that's my forte. Both backbones and bases pairing up four ways. It was discovered by Watson and Crick. But there was Rosalind Franklin, and she got no credit. Yeah, the past is the past, but DNA still remains to give life to others so they carry on the flame. And if you manage to clone that, then guaranteed your wallet will be fat. <laughs> this reminds me of the film Eight Mile, except I'm a teacher and he's a child. Hey. But what do I get up to in my lab? I'm cooking crystal meth, just like out of Breaking Bad. Hey. Okay, so that's a bit of a joke, but science isn't just about white hair and grey coats. Okay. <laughs> This is like science wrap soup. You eat the bread, I'll dunk you too. You thought I was fresh meat, but I'm looking hard to beat. You better treat me with care, or I'll be pulling out all my grey hair. <laughs> I was up late last night, making my rhymes watertight. Not even osmosis can enter tonight. You should go onto Facebook and click like. Oy. So who was the greatest scientist of all time? Darwin's natural selection springs to mind. His views went against religion, but not as much as when he married his cousin. And what about Isaac Newton? He discovered gravity and put poetry to motion. His laws of physics took for 300 years. Then Einstein emerged and reduced his peers to tears. He should definitely be in the list too. He stated E equals MC squared, but I don't get it. Do you? Uh, and what nope. about Galileo? That would be like a tuna sandwich without the mayo. Mayo. Meal. He showed the human race how big space is, and it is a big place. <laughs> Have you heard of Tim Berners-Lee? He invented the internet, and it's free. We should all get down on one knee. He's actually from London, and I bet he has faster broadband than me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who would think science could be so much fun? Go home and thank your mum for sending you to grade me, and later you can come and me. Okay, that's my time. We've had fun. Like Whoopi Goldberg when she played and none. Sister, this is a hard act to beat. The strange thing is, I ain't gonna see you next week. Punch oh, Lane! Mr. Lane! Mr. Lane! Mr. Lane! Mr. Lane! Mr. Lane! Punch Lane!